Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Solomon, founder and CEO of Caraca Private Limited. So uh, I'm here today to talk about our uh, work in graphene for decarbonation construction. So as an organization, we are working towards democratizing the use of graphene, which is a carbon-based nanomaterial for decarbonizing uh, concrete. So and the reason uh, we are very uh, keen to address this problem is, as you understand, uh, construction is one of the uh, you know most energy-intensive industries, right? So we are looking at uh, utilizing materials like cement and steel, which cumulatively uh, account for more than 16% of the carbon emissions. And uh, and a recent survey states that of every 10 liters of industrial water used, one liter goes into construction. So uh, having said that, uh, there are only a limited amount of opportunities to decarbonize cement as a raw material. But uh, there are a lot of opportunities to decarbonize concrete for use in construction, right? So, uh, and, uh, and besides that, uh, there are other direct and indirect carbon emissions associated, associated with this industry. So uh, there are uh, several possibilities where graphene can be used to decarbonize this. And that's exactly where uh, our work lies. So, and to uh, introduce about uh, graphene, graphene is uh, often known as the wonder material of the 21st century. Uh, there are a lot of uh, applications with graphene possible because of its uh, cross-functional electrical, mechanical, and thermal properties. Uh, and uh, it has been in, in research for the last uh, two decades, but uh, there has not been a lot of commercial work done in using graphene in specific industries, right? So uh, what we have done is basically we have uh, developed a manufacturing platform for graphene with which uh, we could scale the production at a, uh, you know, at a uh, adaptable cost benefit ratio. So basically what we have done is we have uh, developed uh, Asia Pacific's first uh, universal graphene manufacturing platform called TerraMax which is uh, industry agnostic with which we can manufacture graphene for more than uh, 10 industries including composites, concrete, uh, paints and coatings uh, to name a few. So using this platform we are able to basically manufacture graphene and provide it to the uh, concrete industry at a, at a viable cost benefit ratio. And, uh, the, and uh, the interesting aspect about our production process is that uh, when you look at the uh, global companies manufacturing graphene, we are one among the top five uh, lowest cost manufacturers and we hold uh, IP across the entire value stream, right? Right from the way graphene is manufactured, the machine that is used, to the way how it is deployed in actual uh, concrete. We hold IP across this platform and that's exactly what is unique about the, the nature of our work. So having said that, uh, we have uh, achieved PRL level nine with this product and we have a uh, certifications report which claims that by using uh, a graphene, permeability, uh, strength, uh, as well as uh, you know, long-term durability can be improved. So we have enough data points about that which I'll be happy to discuss you know, later uh, personally. So uh, using this, we are able to holistically improve the performance of concrete and uh, this has a lot of implications for certain markets. So, uh, and to adopt this product, we have uh, basically, this is basically a water-based product which can be adopted without friction using the income, you know, available existing industrial processes. Uh, and, and that is something unique about our solution as well. So uh, looking at how we are deploying this product right now, we are uh, basically uh, looking at uh, training the personnel in this industry and basically uh, giving them this, giving this product as an admission to these uh, companies who could uh, basically dilute this during the casting process. So that is one of the use cases that we are currently, uh, pilot, current, which we have currently piloted and which we are uh, working to commercialize right now. And beyond that, we also understand that precast could be a larger opportunity for uh, this kind of applications. So we are also tapping that market in the upcoming days. So looking at the carbon footprint, right? the, 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 the uh, methodology by which we are able to reduce or mitigate carbon footprint is by reducing the amount of steel, water, and cement used in construction. And based on the data points that we have with us, we are able to uh, uh, mitigate up to 25% of uh, CO2 in this industry. So this accounts for a, a billion dollar in only as, uh, only this sector would account for a billion dollar in global markets. So uh, the model is basically to deploy this as a solution to uh, end users uh, uh, by training personnel to adopt this product. So we have a team with decades of industry in uh, graphene techno commercialization as well as uh, construction business. So uh, I believe we have the team in place to commercialize this product uh, with us. So uh, we have got the uh, preliminary uh, certifications and we are looking at getting NABL certification in the upcoming days. Uh, and the product is already piloted with a construction company based in Coimbatore. And we have also lined up a couple of uh, pilots in the upcoming days. So uh, we are looking at uh, uh, strategic partnerships who could, uh, who could help us deploy this uh, product at their sites. So, uh, so these are some of the partners who helped us develop this product from get-go. So uh, happy to take any questions that you have personally. Yeah. Thank you. 
Great. Thank you very much. Hang on one second before I let you go. Let's get uh, Arivia on stage. So tell me something, graphene is extremely difficult to manufacture, right? And supposedly unhealthy. How did you guys master it? What's, what's the story here? Yeah. Uh, so, so basically, uh, what we do is we uh, use uh, low-value graphite tailings, which is uh, you know available in industry, and we basically have a water-based exfoliation platform where we bas uh, basically uh, introduce graphite, uh, water, and certain additives, which are basically exfoliated as per the dosing required for this industry. So, uh, maybe I'll concentrate the full picture. Sounds good. It's, it's extremely cool technology. All right.